Hey everyone, I just turned in my last final and I'm officially a college graduate. I'm done with school. I decided that my project over the summer before I start med school would be to completely clean out and redecorate my entire room. If you didn't know this already, I'm going to med school in the fall. Med school is four years and I got accepted into a med school that is commuting distance away from my parents' home. So I moved back home and I'm gonna be living at home for the next four years. So I decided it's time for my room to have a change because I haven't been in this room for a long time and honestly, it's okay. It is Monday, May 11th, and today will be the first day of me working on it. This is a summer long project, so I don't know when I will be done, hopefully by July, sometime before school starts. I want this room to be a completely new room. I don't even wanna be able to recognize it. So follow me along this journey as I try to redecorate it. progress I made so far. I got rid of most of my clothes and now I just have to go through the stuff that was at the bottom of my closet to clear it out. I have a whole bunch of hangers. I think I'm just going to pick those up and put those up for right now but low key. I don't know if it's extra to just order new hangers that match because these just look a mess but I don't know if I'll that later. And some of this stuff is trash and some is donate slash show and some is keep. So that's what I'm about to do right now. Go through, see what's trash, what's donate, and what is key. It is now Tuesday, May 26th, I think. And yeah, so last week was just really unproductive. I haven't been working on my room for at least over a week now. So today I'm finally getting back into it and I'm trying to have a really productive week in terms of my room. As of the last update, I had worked on my desk and then I needed all the stuff I wanted to keep from my desk. I needed a storage bin to put all that stuff in because I needed more storage because I wanted to save that stuff. And that's where I'm at. And then I'm now working on my dresser, going through what I'm keeping, what I'm donating. So I'll show you guys that. So all the stuff that from my desk that I wanted to keep. So I got this new storage bin and it's flat. It's a good size because it could just go on your bed. So I have that. This is still just clothes that I'm not gonna do anything with them yet because I need my new dresser in here first and my new hangers before I hang in or put up any of this stuff. These are my Goodwill bags. Um, and then this is the dresser that I'm working on right now. And so, so far these are the clothes I'm keeping. This is the stuff that's either trash, this will go in the box, the memory box and trash and yeah, so. I did four drawers so far. I'm on the fifth one, so I have one more after this, and then I'm gonna figure out, most of this stuff probably will go in the bathroom until further notice, because it's like products, all my skincare products, all my hair care, because I like to do it in here. Um, but I'm probably just gonna move most of that into the bathroom, clear this off, and figure out, try to start moving this out of my room. The closet is still doing fine. I just think I'm gonna get new hangers. And yeah, so this is the bed, still just a mess. It's 
stuff, literally everything into my closet <laughs> until I have my new stuff where I can put it. So I know I just cleaned out my closet, but it's fine. I'm gonna stuff everything in there for now. And then once I get my dresser up here, the one that I'm actually gonna use, I can take, start tackling all these clothes. I probably should order the hangers I want now. All right, you guys, so I feel like I made a lot of progress today. So my bed is just my bed. This little pile of things is stuff for my mom. This is the bin that's gonna go under my bed um, whenever I put my bed in the position I want it to be. Suitcase, I have nowhere else to put it. Um, this is all trash. And then this is stuff that I'm currently using. Like the blue bag is all my skincare and any type of toiletries is all in there. And um, my jewelry bags and my hair products are all right there. And then this is also stuff that I need that I just don't have a place for right now. So yeah, that'll just, um, when it comes time to like move my bed and like vacuum my whole room, I'll move that stuff into the hallway and then move it back. And then when I have the furniture, I'll have places for everything. So the dresser is completely empty. I'm just going to, I know it's so, it's so dusty and so much makeup on it, but I'm gonna start by moving the drawers out. been productive I've ordered my bedding my sheets my comforter and my bed frame and that all has come in already and I also ordered pillows um not decorative pillows just regular pillows but those haven't come yet and I ordered hangers all new hangers for my closet and that hasn't come yet since the bedding has come I'm about to clear everything out of my room and vacuum and wipe down everything and then set the bed up. I'm out of breath. Don't ask me how my carpet got this dirty because I don't know. I'm about to go in with the, the little small little vacuum so I can get the edges because the edges have so much dirt. 
And then we're gonna start building this bed. I don't remember the last time I've seen my room empty. Have my, has my room ever been empty? I don't even know if my room's ever been this empty. Other than when I first moved in. Here's the room. Oh my God. This is crazy. Room looks so different when there's nothing in it. It looks so much smaller without any furniture in it. It looks bigger with furniture in it. That's it. y'all here's the update of the day i gotta get a new lamp <laughs> i have to put stuff on the walls i need a new mirror and my pillows i ordered pillows they haven't come yet so these are just temporary but i like it i might keep this basket in here i don't know yet i have to back in the styrofoam up but I think it's pretty good space. It looks very open. Um, I think I'm gonna leave this space clear and just put the dresser there. keeping the clear ones um these are all the clothes i folded <sighs> these are clothes that i know i'm gonna hang up so i just have to wait till i get my hangers i'm probably gonna put my dirty clothes in this one clothes are all folded and organized for my suitcase two laundry baskets so these are basically all the clothes i own that are going in the drawers <sighs> so yes my package came. So these are the updated pillows. I put the two pillows I ordered with the pillowcases that came with the sheets. And then all these other pillows my mom had that she said she's not using. So I'm using those. And I probably want to get like a couple more pillows. Maybe ones with color in them and yeah. hey y'all so it is currently june 18th i believe i feel like i haven't worked on my room in so long it's been like two weeks probably but i was waiting on us to move my dresser up to my room and we basically just never got to it and then we thought it would be too heavy for us to lift but me and my mom and my brother tried it and it actually ended up not being that heavy. So I finally moved it into my room and it's kind of like a dark brownish color, but I just want it to be black just so it looks cleaner because it also got like scratched up in the move and stuff. So I'm gonna attempt to paint it, but um, 
I'm scared because I don't know anything about painting furniture. So yeah, I think I want to, I probably won't finish today because it's already almost six o'clock and I tend to wind up my days pretty early. I tend to wind my days up at like eight and settle down. So I'm not trying to be working on this all night, but I will show y'all everything now. So my room's currently a mess. Um, these clothes have been on my bed for the past two weeks, but I moved into the floor. This is my bed right now. It's just a mess. My dog sleeps in here with me. So her stuff is over there. And this is the dresser. So you can see it's, the color isn't bad, but I just feel like it'll look better if I just paint it black and scratched up. So I got, this is primer I got apparently. Okay, so first you're supposed to sand. I don't know anything about this y'all. You're supposed to sand first. So I have the sandpaper. You're supposed to sand everything first. Then you have primer because primer is essential, I guess. And then you have, oh, this is the, wait, is this the? Oh no, this is the primer, sorry. First you have primer because it's essential. And then this is the paint. I got latex paint. Somebody recommended that type of paint for dressers and I got it in black. And um, so first everyone says, I think before you sand it, you're supposed to wash it with soap and water. So I didn't know this bowl had a hole in it. <laughs> So it's leaking, so I put another bowl, but this is my bowl of soap and water, ignore my deodorant. And these are cloths to wash it, so I'm about to wash it down with this water. And then I have this tape, it's like honestly so dirty because it was sitting in my garage with all that dirt and dust. So this is tape and then a knife to try to open these paint cans. These are the paint brushes. Well, I'm gonna be using the big one, so 